Good morning, it's day 12 um, of the 10 minute daily style challenge. It's also Friday, so another week gone. That's the second week in um, self distancing and for me being at home um, all the time. So yeah, listen, day 12. So yesterday, I said to you, let's try and rebuild some outfits. Let's try and uh, reinvent items that we maybe not have worn for a while because now um, you've got a really organized wardrobe. You're now able to see what you've got. Um, and sometimes you can't, you know, you find those little gems and you think, oh, I didn't know that shirt was underneath that jacket or I didn't realize those trousers that were double folded on the hanger I actually had. So hopefully now you've got um, that organized wardrobe doing the next few stages are really gonna Help. So we did trousers and tops, um, different accessories and different um, shoes yesterday. I think let's try and do some skirts today. So skirts are one of the garments that people find really hard to wear. And it's always because of, I don't know what to wear on the top half. Um, but actually, if you treat a skirt like a pair of trousers, it forms the same um rules actually so you've still got the proportions you've still got the fit and you've still got the upper and lower body so obviously some of your skirts may be pencil skirts some of them may be straight skirts some of them may be um the circle skirts so lots of the pleated this season some of them may be over the knee and again you're going to start to play with different fabrics could be um cotton could be pleather could be um like a suede. They could also be a jersey fabric because they're comfortable as well. So whatever skirt you've got, again, just treat them like a pair of trousers. And today we'll do the same exercise as we did yesterday. So with the skirts, look at the different tops that you can put with it, the shirts, look at different uh, knitwear that could go with it. Um, and again, it's different because obviously with a trouser, you've got the length. With a skirt, you potentially have got a shorter length, whether they fall just below the knee, whether they fall on the knee, above the knee, um, or even mid-calf. You're looking at different proportions. So from a top perspective, we don't want to go too long on the top and then go for the skirt because you'll change the proportion to go for a longer upper body and a shorter leg. So a lot of the skirts um, that we wear, they suit um, upper body garments that you can tuck in. So either the ones that you can tuck in, so you see the upper body break on the waist and then the lower body. Um, and that's the kind of proportions you still need to keep. If you go for a longer top, and then you've got your skirt, suddenly your lower body looks a lot, lot shorter. So sometimes that's why skirts, people find it a little bit more difficult as well. They just say, oh, it just doesn't look right. Um, and it's probably because the proportions are wrong. So for today, take out a couple of the skirts, take out a couple of different, different tops or knitwear that you've got um, and just see how they go. It may be also that a top that you really like that goes with a skirt, you've never tucked it in before. So, so change how you're looking at them. Um, maybe tuck it in, maybe just tuck the front in, maybe just tie a knot in the top um, and have the rest tucked in. Loads of different ways you can wear it. Just try doing something a little bit different. Um, and then again, go and find another piece of accessory. It could be one of your scarves that you've got this time today. It could be a different necklace that you don't normally wear with the top. And again, skirts are really interesting from a footwear point of view because lots of people um, struggle sometimes with what to wear with a skirt or for their feet. However, now, obviously the world's your oyster because you've got trainers, you could do ankle boots, you could do a shoe boot, you could do a knee high boot. Um, there's loads. So go Go to your wardrobe, have a look, um, see what else you could put with them that you wouldn't normally wear. And obviously, it will be dependent on where you prefer to wear that skirt. If it's a work skirt, then potentially you're not going to wear a pair of trainers. Um, but if it's a skirt that you can maybe mix around a little bit, then you know wear casually, then try that. Um, and if it's a work skirt, just look at alternatives. It could be a little ankle boot you put with it. It could be a shoe boot, just to mix it up. It could even be a different colour shoe that you might have. So skirts and tops today, let's have a look at those. Let's try and generate some outfits. Um, and again, send me any photos over that you've got. I'd love to see them. Have a really good day.